what has been your experience shifting from mainstream TV to, you know, having a channel where you you <laughs> you, you, you have to push the content on your own? Yeah. Um, it's difficult. Every time you decide to become a self-employed person, I think it comes with a lot of difficulties because you don't have another source of income where you're going to actually get this money. Mm -hmm. You see that? Mm -hmm. Unless, of course, you have people who believe in the dream that you have, which is a very lucky thing for me because I was very well connected. I've had a couple of friends come on board and they say, oh, I'll do this for free and nice. um, I'll do your camera work, I'll do your sound. I'll make sure maybe I get us a Zoom H6 so we can get better sound with time. Um, but it's difficult because you don't have, let's say, um, on TV, they'll run a few promos for you or oh, these guys are going to have maybe uh, a Friday show and it's going to be like this. That's not the same thing with um, YouTube channels. And the industry is still very virgin in Uganda. I would encourage a lot of young people to dive into it. You don't have to wait to be hired by NBS or NTV. You can just go ahead and do whatever you have to do because the space is free for you to create and you have the ability to push exactly what you want. 